Hello, I'm Bob Graff, the Economic Development Coordinator for the City of Missouri City. I want to welcome you to another segment of Bob on Business, where we highlight new commercial development here in Missouri City. Today we're going to look at three areas of Missouri City that have seen new commercial development. One is Lakeview Business Park, two is our Guest in a Road Corridor, and three, the new businesses along Highway 6. Our first stop today is here at Lakeview Business Park, which is located in the northern part of the city at Buffalo Run in Fondren, across from Buffalo Run Park. The developer of this project is Trammell Crow, and the location has great access to Beltway 8, Highway 90, and the Fort Bend Toll Road. There is over 168 acres of attractive land that will provide a great setting for new businesses to locate. One such company is Lufkin Automation. They have purchased 6.2 acres of land for their high-tech headquarters, and as you can see, have already started construction of their new 40,000 square foot building. If the weather cooperates, they hope to be in their new facility by the end of the year. Recently, we had a chance to attend their groundbreaking ceremony. Well, there, there are several things. One is that our, our current location is just a little ways from here, so it was easy for our workforce to move here. But the big deal for this site was the, the character of the site itself. It's a, it fits our high-tech, uh, operation here we think it'll be a place that we can attract a good workforce so we think it's perfect and uh, you know the Missouri City people were fantastic to work with. We will initially move about uh, 45 to 50 employees here at, at some point in time if we need to grow our, our presence here another another uh, 40,000 square feet or so that, that personnel base will wind up growing with that. Um, we've got Trammel Crow as a developer of this business park and uh, they're top quality, you couldn't find a better partner to have in your city than a Trammel Crow. So we were, uh, we were glad to work with them, uh, Fort Bend County, City of Missouri City, both uh, working close hand in hand to, to bring a company like Lufkin and to kick off the business park with our first, first tenant, our first build to suit is a, a real success and a testament to the cooperation we have here in Fort Bend County, Missouri City. I'm just thrilled to death that you all have picked Missouri City to be your headquarters uh, for your people. Uh, and you know, uh, I think as you will learn today as, as we go through the, the, the growth period for your company that we're going to supply you with the workforce that you need, very quality workforce that, that you may need to, to come to Missouri City and, and ask for, but I'm especially proud that you're the, you're the anchor here that's beginning what I, what I know and, and what uh, the city knows is going to be an outstanding project. To the Lufkin people, I'll make one commitment to you. Uh, you're going to be glad that you came to Missouri City because, uh, you know, our, our motto here is, uh, you know, one that uh, we're very proud of. It's called the Show Me City, and we're going to show you why you came here. So thank you. One other thing that makes Lakeview Business Park attractive to companies today is that there are three completed shell buildings ready for tenants to move in. There is a 38,000 square foot, a 50,000 square foot, and a 150 square foot building available today for sale or lease. Our second stop today is along the Gessner Road Corridor, which is located on Gessner Drive between Beltway 8 and Highway 90. Behind me are the two new industrial buildings constructed by Stream Realty, one containing 116,000 square feet and the other 166,000 square feet. Here in Building 1, Professional Packaging, or as they're known as ProPack, has leased 58,000 square feet for their repackaging business. Their main business is to bundle a variety of Frito-Lay products into larger packages that you see in Randall's, Kroger's, Sam's, and other retailers. In the second building here in back, Charm and Charlie has leased 144,000 square feet of the available 166,000 square feet there. Charm and Charlie has 36 locations, nine of which are in the Houston area and surrounding areas, and will be using this building as their main warehouse and distribution center to their retail locations located in Southeast Texas. Across Gessner from the Stream Project is a different type of industrial park built by the National Realty Group. This project has eight individual buildings ranging in size from three to 8,000 square feet. It is called Greystone Park and is located in the 13300 block of South Gessner. 
They hope to attract small to medium-sized companies who would like to lease or purchase their own building. As of today, they have leased or sold four of these buildings. Our last stop today is along the Highway 6 corridor, where we've also seen a lot of new business activity. Here at the Fort Bend Town Center, at the Fort Bend Toll Road and Highway 6, we have had several new businesses coming to complement the new Kroger Superstore. Also on the Highway 6 corridor is another new business that we would like to highlight today, a new medical facility called Excel Urgent Care. Recently we had a chance to talk to the doctor who helped build this facility and tell us why he decided to move to Missouri City. Uh, as a ER room physician myself, uh, I realized while working in these emergency rooms that about uh, 70 to 80% of what we were seeing were not technically true emergencies, uh, which by definition implies that if there isn't immediate attention to the condition, you could expect reasonably to have some sort of impairment or serious bodily function or li uh, loss of life or limb. A lot of what we were seeing were not cases like this and could easily and much more cost effectively be handled in an urgent care setting. I have several friends in the area who told me that there was a need out here for a similar service and that's why we chose Missouri City. It's an area that's showing a lot of growth. It's an area that shows both growth in the residential and in the commercial sector and uh, for us that's a nice fit. Missouri City continues to be an attractive place for companies to locate and these companies will bring new jobs to our area along with a higher quality of life for the whole community. Well that's it for today, but stay tuned to Missouri City TV for the latest updates on commercial developments here in the city and also online at MissouriCityTX.gov. I'm Bob Graff for Bob on Business and we'll see you next time.